sometimes the car has, I don't know what the fuck is happening. You know how your, your luggage? Your luggage? My luggage. You can put on luggage, you know, so. Oh, like my hockey bag, eh? Your hockey bag, whatever. <laughs> what a trip, you know? I get caught for a minute, you know I what? Fuck. <laughs> we will walk more than four miles. You know, you ready for that? Don't worry. I it Don't complain. Me. Took her one week, you know? That's for one day, yeah. let's go! Shit. <laughs> this way? You're just walking. It's a little far, don't worry, I mean, it's not. You take an I think a five I don't miles? Care. Goes down or something? Yeah. No, this is weird, you know. You only have a week. Do you have the keys? Uh, to the room. room. You know, that was so weird. The guy didn't charge us anything for the room. We don't, even we don't have to pay nothing. He said, we can go to the restaurant and order anything. That's, that's so weird. Yeah? So I gotta, I gotta leave uh, this. Okay, I'll see you up at the room. I catch you a little later.
Hey, how you doing? So, what's your name? My name's Gunther. Oh, nice to meet you. And you? My name is Eric. I arrived yesterday, but uh, everything so weird to me. But the, I, it's, it, it seems to me like a ghost down here or something. We have a car accident, my, me and my wife, and uh, we're looking for a mechanic. So that's so weird. The car stopped in the middle of... Hang on a minute. I think we better talk. Before you head on into town. So, the main problem, I'm trying to find a mechanic, but in all the hell time I couldn't find it. You know, that's so weird. No, but you don't want to come here. There's something evil about this place. I've only been here a couple of years. I came here when I was 18. I just turned 20 two weeks ago, and look at me now. I can't leave, because if I walk back past this bridge, my existence stops. So that means that all, all the people that came here get older or something? Uh, I don't know. I'm trying to figure out what's causing it. But don't bring your wife here. You know, my, my wife and I, we have to leave uh, this town tomorrow morning. We have to be in a corporate meeting of, of our work. Well, the closest town, probably about 40 miles away, but once you check in, I don't think it's possible to check out. I've been trying it for two years, and in them two years, I've seen my life go downhill from a young man to an old man. One people try to escape the rubber rafts that they had used to make a balloon. But that got hung up through a breeze in the trees. And when I finally got to them, they looked like they'd been up there lying for over a hundred years. They were all just skeletons and a few dry skins left. The only luggage they had was a paper and pencil I found with a note that read, we got to be free. So, if, uh, if there is a clue, you know, to escape or find a way out from here? Yes, it's, there's got to be a way out. I'm so close to finding the answer. It's, it's just getting to me because I'm right there because I need to get out of here. I don't want to die here like everybody else did. The thing is, 
his traveling priest that came through here about 200 years ago, he had found this uranium mine. And in that uranium, because it was solving his problems with arthritis and everything, he thought it was the material that everlasting life was made out of. But as it was healing him, it was killing him. So he buried it underneath this bridge here. And it set up a radioactive. See how beautiful it is here? This is what he's seen. So, the main problem, I'm trying to find a mechanic, but in all the hell time I couldn't find it. You know, that's so weird. No, but. Since my wife passed away, I feel scared that my day could be here soon. Caminando por las calles sin razón 
Yo te busco aunque venga el fin del mundo Trotando caminos a mi favor Yo sé que volverás conmigo Con la esperanza de tu regreso Con la esperanza de tu recuerdo Es difícil olvidar Thank you.